just can't help themselves. They like to touch everything. And this is not the time to reach out and touch. It's you running through my veins. Your love runs through my veins. All right. Good morning, family. So it is about that time again. It is time for us to wrap up, garb up, get outfitted down and go outside and brave this virus yet again. I feel like I was just at the market. We were just there and we already got to go back. Like, I don't know what happened, but I feel like my children have a tapeworm because all they do is eat. All they do is eat. And then we always have to go to the market. Like, but Glamazante had some masks for sale on her website. So they were only one cent, y'all. So I ordered two for the boys, but they're not here yet. So we're going to have to make like a substitute in the meantime. And after, you know, scouring, scouring, after searching, okay, because I can't pronounce that word right now. So after searching <laughs> YouTube, I found a way to make a really quick, super easy mask. You only need a couple bit of things. So before we head out, let me go downstairs. I don't know why my ear is itching. <sighs> let me go downstairs, make these masks. Um, hopefully I have another bandana for me to wear or I'm just going to have to tough it out. Oh, and I found gloves. So we should be good for today. Let's go. Alright guys, so we just got to the market. My mom ugh. my mom is taking the boys for a walk so that they don't have to come in the market with me because they just can't help themselves. They like to touch everything. And this is not the time to reach out and touch. So putting on my gloves. Oh, I hate these ones. Ugh. Like they smell like a balloon and I hate the way balloons smell and they're just, <sighs> they got the powder inside. These are not my favorite gloves, but whatever. All right, so purse check. I feel like I shouldn't even bring in my whole purse and I should just bring in my debit card. 
And no, normally I would bring my cash envelope and do it that way, but now is not the time. Like, I can't keep saying now is not the time enough. Like, there is money is already dirty on its own, and now we got a virus, so it's dirtier. And I'm, I just no. All right, so I'm just gonna take my bank card, put that in my box, but box back pocket, and my keys. I'll clip them to my belt. Y'all see the Aldi sign in the background? I didn't do that on purpose, but I appreciate it. All right, guys. So we are home, and I've laid out the whole haul, as you guys can see. But we're going to start here. Um, I got some turkey breast and string cheese for me to snack on. And then mild cheddar and provolone. Like, I basically cook with these two cheeses so if I like make a take the turkey breast and put it on some uh, tortillas that we have in the refrigerator some low carb tortillas at that I'm trying to get back on my keto kick I'm really trying and I can just wrap the cheese and the turkey breast in the low carb tortilla call it lunch then I got some more oranges for the boys um, I got Hello. lettuce for myself Hello. You're in it right now. Y'all see this one little braid that he keeps insisting that somebody braid this for him. And he has this one little curl just hanging in front of his face. I don't know who he think he is. But I got some more lettuce for me for when I have salads. And then I got two bags of zucchini. I don't know what it is, but if you have not tried zucchini fries before in your life i don't know what's wrong with you what are you waiting for they are bomb like cut these yes chunk oh you put your car on top of all the pizzas cool but back to these zucchinis that are delicious like you cut them in half and then you cut each half into like wedges oil them up some salt some pepper throw them in the oven then add some parmesan cheese to them bomb love it then i finally got some strawberries i already ate one like are you supposed to wash your strawberries off before you eat them probably yes but i never do but i don't know if i really want to eat these because look how big the strawberry is like why more bigger no more bigger oh you're lucky it landed on your table. But like, yeah, it's almost as big as my hand. I don't know if I trust it. But it looks so delicious. But I don't know. I think I'm going to eat it anyway because it looks just so good. Alright, Theo, you're doing the most right now. Okay, thanks. Alright, it's too big. It doesn't fit. So now I have to eat it. It's melting. Mm -hmm. I probably should have washed this off before I just bit into it, but I never do. And it probably has like pesticides and whatnot all over it. Am I going to die? One day, yes. Is it going to be because of this giant strawberry? Who knows? But in the moment, it was good. And I have no regrets. Okay, so I got some cauliflower rice. I haven't really seen this before at Aldi, but I saw it in the circular. Oh, I know. I got to clean that up, Theo. It's okay. I got to wash them off first, Tom Tom. But the cauliflower rice, I've never really seen it before at Aldi. Theo, I just want you to put it down and stop touching it. Um, so they had this kind and another kind. This one's garlic and herb. I got three of these. Um, because I can't have many other sides. And then my good old salsa. Oh, I got mild. I thought this was medium. Damn it. Okay, but whatever. Got my pepperonis. Um, grilled chicken strips for salads. And then my good old burgers. 75 it ain't got these 75-25% um, burgers you know because if I'm in the mood for a taco salad 
I will take a burger and unthaw it, cook it up, chop it up, and put it on the salad, call it a day. Or I'll just have a regular burger. Like, love these. So I got two of these. And then coming around, Theo, I got ground beef. Back up, Theo, because you have on a white shirt. Why you have a white shirt in your pajama drawer, I will never know. But I got ground beef for the boys for when they have like spaghetti and all that stuff. Um, and then these are mostly for me. But um, Jamaican patties. I love the. I used to love these so much. So these will be like my little cheat meals. But um, I'm still holding on to the strawberry. Then I got them. A whole stack of pizzas. It is an easy dinner or a lunch or whatever, and they love them. So, grabbed a whole bunch of them. And then I wanted party wings, but Aldi didn't have any party wings. So, I grabbed this. It's a 10 pound bag of chicken breasts, which I also, this is a mistake. I didn't mean to grab this one. They had a 10 pound bag of chicken tenders, like the just the smaller strips but whatever I can just cut this up and do what I need to do with it um, I got another coffee creamer still the same kind chocolate and caramel I'm telling you put it in your coffee it tastes like you're drinking the Snickers more milk and then the last grocery haul that I did and I showed this to you guys this was the first time I had ever got it and let me tell you I've Missed it when it was all gone because it is so good. So I got two because it is delicious. The vanilla bean Greek yogurt from Aldi is bomb. And then more pork and beans for the boys because they love it. So who am I to argue with them? If they going to eat it, I will buy it. Um, and then I got some general sauce or general sal. Like, I don't know. I've heard people pronounce it so many different ways. But I got that. So I can, when I chop up the chicken and I cook that up, I can put that on there with my cauliflower rice. You know, make meals out of everything I got. Um, I got some more hazelnut spread because the one that we got last time is already gone. Like, once the boys get a taste of something and they decide that they like it, they'll never keep it. I don't know why this happy birthday thing is still here. I thought I took them all down. Um, I got them for snacks. The chocolate chip cookies, the chewy ones again. I need to divide them up. Divide one up and then hide the other one until this one is gone. I got some more of my cashews because I can't live without them. I'm not kidding. And then I got there all these elevation bars. Cookie dough. We're going to see. I don't know. They didn't have protein powder, so I figured I'd experiment with this. And then I got another bag of the granola, the dark, dark chocolate, and sea salt. Listen, the dark chocolate and sea salt on top of this vanilla bean yogurt is the bomb like it is the best breakfast you will ever have then I'm sorry I'm still eating this giant strawberry I got more coffee because I am all out <laughs> I've been going through it like all we had was a couple bags of tea in the house and when that ran out I was like going through withdrawal so got more coffee Got some more cereal because we needed it. So, the Aldi Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Berry Kids Crunch, which is like Captain Crunch, and my beloved shredded wheat. And then I got the Aldi Sweetener, so I don't have to keep using uh, white sugar. That's all my mom eats. So, we're going to try it out. I'm not a big fan of the aftertaste that Stevia has, so hopefully... This doesn't have that, but we shall see. It's a big-ass bag, though. So either way, whether it has it or not, I'm going to be eating it because I bought it. 
Um, and then coming down here, I got some paper plates because dishes, I hate them. Like that is my most hated chore on the planet is doing dishes. And since we're home all the time, it just seems like we never are not doing dishes. Wake up, do dishes, go to sleep, do dishes. Like just after every meal, we're doing dishes. So I just, I got paper plates. And then the crown jewel of the whole haul. Do y'all see it? Get the angles. All the angles. Just strike a pose. He who has toilet paper will rule the world in this day and age. So we're not completely out of the last 12 pack of toilet paper that I bought in the first emergency haul. But I figured why not get more like I'm not one of those hoarders who buy them all and plus they only tell you you can have one paper good but still I figured you can't go wrong if anything happens we got back up so backing up backing up backing up that is everything and now I need to put it away because I think this ground beef is bleeding Yes. All right. So. <laughs> All right. So that is everything. That is our entire emergency grocery haul. So please like, comment, share, subscribe. You know, all that good YouTube stuff. And most importantly, guys, stay safe. Like, I've been watching the news and they're saying that there's going to be like a surge in this virus and that more people are going to get sick and just that's why I mostly bought doubles of everything because I'm really not trying to leave the house so please stay safe most importantly stay home and I'll see you guys in the next one bye